What's up, man? <clears throat> it's your boy, Pat Aris. Quick Sixer Podcast. Quick Sixer Collective. Coming with you. Uh, coming at you with a uh, quick little PSA, you know, public service announcement, you know what I'm saying? Or a field report, if you say, you know what I'm saying? I got to have it, you know, I got to have that backup drink, you know, that Stella can. Anyway, um, this weekend, uh, pre Memorial Day weekend, your boy had an opportunity to test a few beverages. All right. Specifically, a line of beverages that I want to talk to you about real quick. Um, one, which I'm almost done with, this is that uh, Space Dust Dank Dust. Go ahead and check that out. Elysian, this shit. If you if if you if you fuck a weed, go ahead and get this. This shit is this shit tastes like if you're drinking weed. But shout out Beard Dyer, so I'm not drink. You know what I'm saying? Ooh. It's not what we're here to talk about, though. We're here to talk about the hard Mountain Dew series of drinks. Okay. We're talking regular. We're talking Baja Blast. We're talking Black Cherry. And we're talking Watermelon. Okay. You boys, official ranking. Okay. That's where we're going with this. Um, first of all, official ranking. It's going... It's going Black Cherry, Baja, regular watermelon. Watermelon's trash. Your girl, Brittany Fernandez, will have you uh, believe different. Don't believe her. It's trash. Okay. Also, I need to show you guys this color. So go ahead and check out the YouTube version. Go to youtube.com slash quick sixer, and you'll be seeing this. So this is the Black Cherry, Okay. They all come in these like you can buy this all this this whole thing in like a variety pack. Check this shit out. This shit is pink. Okay, pink. You fucking see me through this thing. You know what I'm saying? If we're, you can go check out. Um, <clears throat> you want to see my official ratings of this? Uh, by the way, on tapped or whatever. Go and check out Pat underscore artists on Untapped to see the official ranking and how I scored all these, all four of these. But I'm going to drink a little bit of these. This one smells the best, by the way. Uh, they all kind of taste like they have aspartame in them, um, like almost like a diet soda, no sugar type of situation. Um, yeah, I don't know, man. Like, if I was going to really, I'm, I'm never going to buy these again. Like I bought like all like singles, never gonna buy them again. But this is you know, this you can see my face on the on, like visual. You know, everybody knows me knows I can't really hide a emotion on my face. So here it goes, black cherry Mountain Dew. It's kind of like it's been sitting out for a minute. So we tried them all, and then they just sat out for a bit where we had like regular drinks. You know what I'm saying? So I got to say, I got to say one thing. After a little, after a few other drinks, it's all right. It's all right. Yeah, it's all right. What do you do? Anyway, we're going to move on. This is number one, by the way, Black Cherry. I don't think I've ever had a Black Cherry Mountain Dew, like, just in general, but. Stand by. You got that binks in, you know what I'm saying? He in here. You know what I'm saying? All right. So Black Cherry is number one. That's on our list. Okay. Baja. Baja Blast. So, I think originally, I think I'm not positive about this, but I feel it feels this way. I feel like Baja Blast was a, a Taco Bell exclusive flavor in Mountain Dew for a, a long time. I'm not positive if that's real or if that's just in my imagination. 
That's the only place I ever saw it, though, for a very long time. So the reason I wanted to do this in video format is because I thought it was important to show the <laughs> the fucking colors of these things. Okay. This is Baja Blast. If anybody's ever watched the YouTube version of this show, uh, yeah, bro, you can see my mic. This is a very much a blue, which I mean, if you've ever had Baja Blast in your life, this is a, uh, it's like if you make Sprite with it or something. Kind of what it looks like, you know, like a lighter version of a deal. But it's a close second. Some would say it's a it's a number one. Some in this household would say it's number one. But not me. You know what I'm saying? But Baja Blast. Um, we poured out the other two because watermelon was shit. And uh, regular was just... Whatever, you know, if you've had Mountain Dew, you've had Mountain Dew. But anyway, here's here's, right, here's Baja Blast, you know what I'm saying? Mm. Yeah, I'm going to be perfectly honest with this. Um, After sitting out for a little while, I've, you know, we let it sit, had like a regular drink. This kind of tastes like a... Like window cleaner, maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Looks like it. Probably could clean it. Who's to say? I don't know. But anyways, <clears throat> that's Baja Blast. I also wanted to show off the other two cans in case anybody was interested in checking those out. Uh, you can find them in any grocery stores, gas stations. They come in like, you know, the giant 24 ounce cans. Or I think you can get them in like 12, 12 ounce cans and like the variety pack. But anyways, here's the other two. And of course, in our ranking, obviously. Uh, regular Mountain Dew. It's got an eagle on it. Okay. And watermelon. It's got a snake on it. So there's that. Um, uh, shout out to Green Rebel Brewing Company. That's who does these. So, um, anyways, that is the, oh, actually, you know what? Fuck it. I have a little bit of black cherry back. Let's see what happens with black cherry and Baja mixed. Mm. You can call this cherry Baja or black Baja, however you prefer. But not bad. Not bad. So, anyways, <clears throat> the verdict, the quick sixer verdict, official verdict for the hard Mountain Dew collection Baja Bla or black cherry Baja Blast OG green watermelon in that ranking um if you mix them they turn into a weird fuchsia so anyway it's been your boys liz pet artists go check out quick sister collective all our shit is dope we're dope you're dope for checking this out appreciate it we out.